the satellite saying, Victor? Right now, not a goddamn thing. I lost the signal. Hey, you know what never loses signal? Paper. All right, this route right here should take us straight to the volcano. Might get a little bumpy, though. Let's get the show on the road. Okay. All right. So, what are we looking for out here? Well, the map shows all these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Now, Avery was the most wanted man in the world. So if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. And one of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. Angus crossed. All these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Avery was the most wanted man in the world. So if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. One of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. Fingers crossed. I see some ruins up ahead. Wait here. I'll go take a look. Okay, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest 4x4. Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go. Made it. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. Okay, just keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going on. Ah! We're good. Everything's good. Jesus. Christ. Onward and upward. I think I'm getting the hang of this. There we go. <laughs>
should take this slow, kid. Yeah. So Nathan, you're thinking Avery, too, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities were closing in on him. Sure. Maybe uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. Go check out that tower. I'll come with. It's in pretty good shape for something several hundred years old. Yeah. There. That ought to do it. Ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, not yet. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine, you've come here, a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. Ha <laughs> poor oppressed pirate. All they wanted to do was murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. Taking forever to get to this volcano. Built to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Sam. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a former squid. Oh, shit, stop, stop! Sam. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. That means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. You do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead.
Okay, I think that's it. God damn it. Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. I mean, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. Jesus, he's probably... Again with the winch, Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. All right, hang on, guys. <clears throat> Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than Rafe? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up front kind of merc. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. Staying the same damn thing. What if they found the treasure already? Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Hey, Sam, you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard, saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History. Uh, hey, you think that old building's worth checking out? So, we were talking about... Um, oh, right. History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates, just in case, you know. Sure. But, you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it. Sam, if you... Check it out, boys. What is it? Cool. Shit. 
You can probably see all of King's Bay from up here. Yeah. Hey, look. There's the city. And there's the river valley. Guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? Can't tell. Well, it would appear we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. <laughs> what do you make of the drawbridge, Nathan? A little out of place. But you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to protect something. Such as pirate treasure? Maybe. Be careful, kid. Hey guys, there's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Bingo. Sam! Special delivery! You got this? Mm-hmm. I seen it. I'll bring the car closer. <laughs> Are you two just relax? I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know? <laughs> Keep up the good work, kid.
go before more shorelines show up. Hey. Right. Now, let's get that bridge down. Try that again. There we go. One sec. I'll just wait with Sam. I'm good. Let's go. Big tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? The nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? Well, I think it's worth a try. I'm gonna take a look around. So just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, half. Half of what? Well, he only knows about the Gunsway heist. Which is worth 400 million. <laughs> right, but if Nathan's theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure in play. Well, you should have told him it was 200 down. You never tell your partners how much a job is really worth. Wasn't exactly expecting to be partners with him. Guys, we're gonna find it, pay off that lunatic, and still have plenty to spare. Trust me. There we go. We're all set. Here we go. Don't spin out now. Definitely sharing this one with my shrink. <laughs> Wait, you have a shrink? No, but I will after this. Come on, you guys are overreacting. Get the whole thing under control. Find our way in. 
Let's go claim our treasure, boys. Get in that way. Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. Let's see what we got here. There's something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Damn. It's breaked over. All right, let's look around. Hey, careful with that thing, kid. Heads up! Oh, Jesus! I said heads up! This way. He seems excited. Oh, he's got a lot riding on this. See a treasure, though. Hey guys, coming. Check this out. St. Dismas. We meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas, too. And that's, uh... That's, that's Adam Baldridge. That's uh, Joseph Farrell. And that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh... Let's see, what do you think the trick is here? Gotta push a button, pull something? Well, maybe 
Maybe one of the arms or... Give it a shot. <coughs> Come on. Boys, whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this. Trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Fact that you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if we're here, this tower lines up with Avery's sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, a treasure's gotta be in one of them, right? Yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here. Jesus. Is that all of them? Well, let's hope so. You okay? Yeah, yeah, fine. Sam hey, what are you doing? It's confirming a suspicion. Shit. Look at this. They figured out the towers, too. Locations, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed. Okay, because there's three of us, and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. Well, that's great, Nathan, because neither do we. Yes, we do. <laughs> Look, it's a little worn down. Right there, that's a match. Yeah, are you sure? Because, I mean, it could be this one, too. But still, two beats the hell out of 12. All right. I'm gonna take this tower. You and Sully, you take that one. No, 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 no. no, no Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly. So if we want to have a chance to catch them, then we've got to split up. Sam, just hold up a second, will you? Nate, he's right. These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. Damn it. If you run into any of those shoreline clouds, you call us, okay? See you soon. Come on, Nate. We gotta hurry. <laughs> 